Well, a new year brings new laws, and this is a big change. You now have to be 21 years or older to buy tobacco in the state. That includes e-cigarettes, which have become increasingly popular among teens. Now, the new law went into effect today, and with more, here's WBZ's Bill Shields. It really is an epidemic. So. Haley Manning is only in high school, but already has a big victory under her belt, seeing the minimum age for buying tobacco go up to 21 years old. I still think that there's a number of other steps that we have to keep taking in order to end big tobacco for once and for all. The 84 stands for 84 percent of the teenagers in this state who do not smoke. But e-cigarettes are grabbing more and more kids. And the new law making the age to buy tobacco 21 also applies to electronic cigarettes. And the 84 movement sees parallels with big tobacco companies and e-cigarettes. The tobacco and vaping industries have been using the same tactics for a number of years um, with cigarettes, and now they're using those same methods to target youth. But someone argued that if someone can vote and join the military at the age of 18, tobacco and e-cigarettes should also be a choice an 18-year-old can make. But in Massachusetts, it's 21 as of today. I think it's a good age, but the the argument with are you an adult at 18 or 21 comes in. And I don't want my kids smoking. I'm okay with it Good. as a health benefit to you guys. I think a lot of 18 year olds don't don't um, have the better judgment as to know you know whether that's good for them or not. So I think 21 is a is a perfect age. These anti-smoking groups realize they've accomplished a lot but they have a long way to go. I'm Bill Shields WBZ News.